This video is going to uh, walk through how to put images into your webs.com website. Now I've never done this before and that's the point of this video is to see how easy it is to figure out how to put images into your website. So the website I've been using as my model um, has been uh, Yoga Reiki AZ and on the site I'm only duplicating a few pages on the site and in the future I will compare other website builders uh, as well. So it's only a few pages like five and then the blog and a photo gallery. Um, so on, on this site there's the bio page that's one of the pages that I will um, put an image in and then there's the home page. So out of those two pages, there's two images, I've already downloaded them and now I want them to do something very similar. So the premise is that if I had a specific look I was going after how easy is it for me to um, to get what I want. So you guys know the specific goal I'm going after. And we have this image of Lisa here that we're going to try to get on the home page and we're tr going to try to get it uh, right in this area. So from a WordPress perspective, um, and I have not reviewed WordPress yet, but um, I use it a lot. From a WordPress perspective, I would click in here, I would choose my image and I would put it in here and um, choose my settings, but it doesn't look like I can get it to wrap right now. So it looks like I can make the image larger or smaller, though this is not moving much. And I have different frames I can put in, but that's not what I want. I would like the image to okay, so here's where I put my image in. All right, hold on, I'll pause while I navigate to I'm gonna click this upload image button and navigate to my image. Okay, so I've got my image in and I can move it around a little bit and that's great, but it looks like I don't get to have my image wrap the text and that's that's what I really want here is I really want the image to be part drop a module here. Okay, I don't want a module, so all right, so I got closer here. I'm not sure exactly how I did that, but <laughs> um, I would like a whole lot to have this image uh, wrap and currently I have no reason to believe it can. <laughs> so I see I have a left, I see I have a right, and I would expect that if I had it set to right that I could get this image to um, to wrap my text. But it doesn't appear that I can do that with with webs here, so um, I'm going to look up some help. Hold on one moment. Okay, so I went to help and I was able to figure out how to do this. It was not intuitive at all. Apparently you need to use the image and text module and I have no idea what, and I put the image in first to make this work, so um, I did not find this intuitive at all, but here we'll go ahead and do this um, again. So right now 
I guess this is just a text module, though I don't see one down here. So if you drag the image and text module in, then you can double click to add an image. Then I can upload an image and I can put my image in and there it is. And on this particular, oh I didn't do it quite right for the other one, but on this particular um, page she has the image of herself to the right of the text for her bio. So I'm going to click the image and go to the right. I'm going to take this text out of here because I couldn't get the image in that way. So we're going to paste and now we're going to get rid of this extra module that's hanging out here. And let me see if I have everything the way we need it. So I've got a title now and I don't want that title. Hold on. Oh, that should say career highlights. Maybe I just didn't do that earlier. There we go. And then you can scale down the image and uh, And so that is how you get an image in and you get it to wrap text. <laughs> so not the most straightforward thing like if you did the process I did and you put the text in first. Apparently things don't play all that nice. Um, but once you look it up and help and I was able to find it and you know you can drag image and text in then um, it seems to be fine. It just seems backwards. It seems like I should just be able to put that image in there but um, you saw there that that did not play nice. So there probably is a trick to working with text that are like here. If I wanted to put text in somewhere in here and I drag an image in it's not letting me. So um, <laughs> that's the problem is that I've got to, you know, kind of move my text around a bit. But we got there. So, um, you know, I would rate this as as a as a 50 50 experience because I was able to figure it out very quickly. But um, it was not intuitive whatsoever. So I got there, but 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 just because I know how to use help really well. So that is my experience adding images into, te into a text area with webs.